Listen, I love tickle bitties as much as the rest of you guys, but this TikTok trend needs to stop. I feel like everyone has just kind of accepted seeing thirst traps on their For You page, clearly trying to funnel people to their OnlyFans. And there's nothing particularly wrong with that, but this new trend takes it to a whole new level. Let me set the scene to you guys. I'm at work, sitting in the middle of all my coworkers, scrolling through TikTok, as one does. And I come across this video and it looks seemingly innocent. It looks like a cleaning orientated video. I'll show the video shortly after this. And this lady's about to go clean her sink. I'm like, wow, I love watching people clean their sinks. It's very satisfying, you know, it's nice to see. And so I get all comfortable, you know, I can settle into my position. I watch the video. The first 99% of the video is this woman walking to her sink. And then in the last second, that last percent, all of a sudden, she's just completely naked in the reflection of the faucet. For obvious reasons, I cannot play the full video, but I'll play as much of the video as I can with my rendition of the song over it. I'll be the cash, you'll be the rubber band. Na, 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 na. As you can tell, the video is completely normal, and then I ended it right before this last scene, where if you see in this part of this part of the faucet, clear as day, you can see her. So just imagine that, but no clothing. And obviously, this is problematic. Before I explain why, let's go on to the second one. It's the exact same concept of the video, except the exact opposite. This video starts off with a woman completely naked in a dark room with a door slightly open, with literally just her tit hanging out in front of the door. I blurred it out, but like you can kind of picture, you can fill in the rest of the image from here. And then the rest of the video is just her dancing out in the middle of, no, in the middle of her room. Like, like nothing happened. Like, let's be clear. These videos are not here because they're redefining the genre of content on TikTok. They are clearly for the express purpose of funneling people who view these videos into their OnlyFans account. And the problem is a lot of these people that are viewing these videos to get funneled to an OnlyFans account are actually children. And so there's this idea now that these kids should go continue the rest on OnlyFans. And like, I don't think that's particularly healthy for kids to be going to like OnlyFans like websites that a young age, obviously there's kids in their teens who are probably fucking eating this content up and obviously adults as well. But we got to kind of cater the content towards the kids on the app because they don't really know better. They're just going to do it and they're going to see more. And I feel like in that stage of their development, it's not the best. There's many studies showing that pornography at too young of an age isn't healthy for children's development. So by promoting that, I think that's a very bad thing for these kids on TikTok. There's nothing wrong with the videos themselves. The problem is where they're being posted. If these videos were being posted on the hub or even Twitter or Reddit, there's nothing really wrong with that. Those apps aren't designed for children to use. TikTok is a kid's app. The automatic detector is not advanced enough to detect this yet. So it's kind of up to us to actually report it and make sure these videos are not spreading any more than they could. Because at the end of the day, kids are on this app and it's, I know it's designed for technically kids and it's used for other purposes, but I feel like there's thirst traps and then there's full on nudity and that jump is pretty big for kids and I feel like actually getting rid of it is probably not the worst thing in the entire world for them. Because if you want to see porn, just go to Pornhub. Go to like Reddit or Twitter if that's your cup of tea. Go to your deep phantom websites no one knows about. Go there. T TikTok should be for shitty memes, gameplay, cooking, cleaning, whatever you want to look at on there. It should not be for nudity. Now, because all I can say is it, people might not have a problem with it now, but this will definitely escalate and eventually guys will start doing that. And as soon as that starts happening, like obviously people will take more than that. So I think by starting it now and people being aware of what's probably to come if nobody takes advantage of this, um, we should probably start now before it escalates to a whole nother level of potentially insane things happening on TikTok.